All right, guys. So we're out here at the good old Elk River. Or actually, this is the Indian, but we're floating from the Indian into the Elk today. What are we gonna be doing? Oh, we're gonna be slaying some smallmouth all day. Y'all heard that here first. So we're gonna be slaying some smallmouth. Hopefully, catch some really good ones. We're both got our GoPros on today, so if we catch anything big, it should be recorded. And let's hope for a good day. Oh yeah. We'll see you out there. All right, guys. Let's get a little sneak peek on what we're gonna be throwing today. Got me a mega bass popper there. So hopefully catch a largemouth on that. And I got a rage crawl and a little jig head and a small fluke. I got the jig tied on for backup. That's always the best out here. But we're gonna try these other things first, see if we can get some different bites. Got fish jumping already over here. All right, let's see what I'm throwing today. I got, I believe I got two swim baits tied on and then a good old classic, classic Texas rig. Got this beautiful shat. Axolotl, a little throwback wake walker. And then like I said, you can't go wrong with a Texas rig. But let's hope today we catch some good fish and y'all stick around for the ride. First one of the day. Not gonna be putting him on the wall, but you know what? It's always good to start with a fish. But I told you this little thing is gonna catch him, bro. Oh, no, you said you said good luck with that. You were hating on it. No, no. This thing's about to be a goggle eye slayer, dude. So the fish I just caught is called a Ozark bass. We always call them goggle eye. Uh, it's a pretty cool fish because this is the only area in the world you can catch those fish. They're a certain breed that only lives in the creeks and lakes here in the Ozarks. So they're not, they're a fun fish to catch because they bite really good. Like you can catch them, you can hook them. Uh, they get off and you throw back in there and they'll eat it again. They're that aggressive. So they're a fun fish to catch. They get quite a bit bigger than that one. Hopefully we, uh, Catch a couple today that are a little bit bigger. There's a bite. Oh, that's a perch. Gotcha. Oh, yeah, big old rock bass. That right there is a rock bass, also known as a goggle eye. Absolutely beautiful little fish. Okay, buddy. Maybe he'll calm down there. Beautiful. Let's let him go. That crystal clear water. The juice. Ah.
That was cool. I don't know if y'all saw that, but I was just reeling in my little rage crow. And this little old bass decided he wanted that thing. Nice. That's, oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. There we go. Not that big. Still a nice fish to catch though. It's another one on that Rage Crow Texas rig. Nice. by any means, but another decent one. Just crushing that Texas rig. Smacked a little top water. Oh, oh yeah, look at him fight. There we go. A little river large mouth. Yeah, it's a pretty good one. No, uh, top one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A bluegill, a sunfish. Just so nobody gets upset that we call it a perch down here. There's one. Hit the fluke. You got one? Yeah. Nice. Oh shoot, I think I'm getting a bite too. Oh shoot. Oh, yep. Oh, I got a good one. No way we doubled up. No freaking way. Oh, that's a nice fish. Holy cow. Oh my gosh. You got a big one? Oh shoot. Throw it to the face. Very nice river large mouth right there. Beautiful two and a half pound large mouth, maybe even a touch bigger. Let's get a release on her. Gotta give her a smooch. Thanks for biting, fish. I really appreciate you. You have a good day. Yeah, you. Well, that was sick. So what happened? I bring my little jig along. Just got a little tool. Set the hook. I ain't gonna believe what's on the end of this thing. Yeah, show me. Let me get my toes next to it too. Yeah. I want to make sure. A big one. He's got something big. Oh. <laughs> Look at that thing. He hit the jig. That is a big snapping turtle. <laughs> oh my gosh, Nick. Look at its head, dude. It looks that's huge. 
Yeah, I'm gonna get my toes over there. Give me a second. What do I do now? You either break the jig or lose a finger. <laughs> oh man, I've never done this. This is the first time I've ever caught a seven turtle. He just absolutely nailed the jig. That is crazy. I was not expecting that at all. So what are you gonna do? I guess I'm gonna lift him. Just kidding. Goodbye, jig. There's one. That's a big one. Oh no, he got me hung up. He's up. Nice. Another one. On the Texas tree. They're just loving that little car right now. Of course, I wasn't recording, but I just threw my little shad over here and caught this nice large mouth. Let's get him in. That right there is a beautiful fish. Look at that thing. Look how he ate that swim bait. Just crushed it. That was so cool. That was so cool. Nice large mouth on that swim bait. Let's go. Give it a little smooch. There you go. Oh, Nick, big one. Oh, no, no, no. Oh my gosh, he came out and crushed it. How did he get off? Oh, how did you get away? I mean, came up and smoked it. There's another one. Nick, another one. On that shit. This is so fun. So sick. Beautiful little bass. Hey bud, you stuck there, bud? Yeah. Me too, bud. It's not tough, bro. It's smart.
Yeah. Hey guys, we're about halfway through our float right now. Been having a great time catching some bass. Uh, if you guys are still here, we appreciate you. I'd like you to drop a, a like, comment, subscribe. We want to hear from you guys, and we really appreciate the view. Yeah, we had a great time. Caught a bunch of fish. We were fishing again up in Missouri on the Elk and Indian River. Uh, Y'all, really, if you have any rivers or any creeks around you in the summertime, make sure to go try them out because when the lakes can get tough, sometimes it's good to move over to those creeks and you know catch a bunch of fish. So. It's always worth it, and uh, we appreciate all y'all's support. Hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Little guy got excited on the fluke. So I was saying about them coming back and biting it again. These guys never give up. Oh, still not giving up. A pretty little fish, though. Yeah, no, you're definitely right. Oh, 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 on the shed. Holy cow, big smallmouth. Holy cow, did you see that, Nick? Dude, he can't. Holy cow. That was sick. Look how he ate that thing. Wow. Dude, check it out. Look at how he ate that thing. I think he won it. Dude, holy cow, he crushed it. Dude, that was so he came up out of the water, bro, like a top water. Like his back and everything, that was sick. There we go. On the swim boat. There's no way. A goggle eye? Dude, that's, I don't think I've ever had that happen before. Look at this. He decided he wanted a swim bait. We're about to rip the tail off this thing. He's going crazy. Another river smelly on the pink fluke. They're liking this little thing. It's a fun bite too. They're just smacking it and running off with it. It's so much fun coming out here on these rivers and fishing. It's just so beautiful and nice out here. And the fish just 
love to eat. They're hyped up. What's it on top? Let's go back to back. It's a little bit better one this time. That's what I'm talking about. Oh yeah, he wanted that thing not to clean up the line. Thank you, Mr. Smallmouth. Oh, here we go. I got a river monster on the way. Full speed, full throttle. <laughs> wow, I got a really big one. <laughs> nice. Spawn off action here on the speed crow. Nice little bite. Dude, as soon as it hit the water, oh my gosh. As soon as it hit the water, that thing was on. That is awesome. Pretty nice little fish too. Pretty nice little fishy there. Whew. Beautiful small mouth. Ate that jig, let's pop that out. Nice fish. <laughs>